has finally sprung here in Cleveland, and now that the temps are warmer, it's finally time for Kayembe to explore his outdoor habitat here at the zoo. So much like humans will baby-proof their house as they're getting ready to introduce their toddlers to new spaces, we did the same. It's not quite the same where you're covering an outlet or anything like that, but what we do is we switched out all the ropes for fire hose, which is safer for him not to be tangled. We added some steps so that he can get up to some higher areas and easily get down. Um, we also covered any large gaps so he can't get any arms or legs stuck anywhere and just made it as safe as possible for him to explore his outdoor space. With his first time outside, it couldn't have gone any better than we expected. The group came out very calm, very normal. Gorillas are all about eating, and so that's exactly what they did. They all went to find their food, and he was on Freddie, his adopted mom, and looking around and very calm and just taking it all in. I saw him sampling some grass and some new things, and it's going to come quick. He's going to be moving quickly and exploring and learning to climb, and it's all going to be happening pretty rapidly over the summer. So while the weather is still variable, we want to make sure that it's warm and dry for the days that we put Kai outside. So we're looking for days where the feels like temperatures above 60 degrees and it's not raining. They'll be outside in the outside habitat, but no worries if it's raining, if it's a little bit chilly, they'll still be visible. They'll just be in their indoor habitat. We're excited for guests to have the opportunity to see Kai explore his outdoor habitat this spring at Cleveland Metro Park Zoo.